This morning, researchers at Ohio State have another reason for you to get enough sleep. Miss out, and you're more likely to snack down the next day. And you'll reach for foods high in carbs, sugar, fat, and caffeine. So, what you want to do is get your seven or eight hours, or you'll be reaching for, you know, too many potato chips or too much kettle corn. Which is one of the four major food groups, by the way. Kettle corn? I, I'll have some later, thank you. You know, nearly three million Americans are living with a heart condition called atrial fibrillation. What is AFib? How do we fix it? Well, a normal heart rhythm should beat like a, like a steady drum. Atrial fibrillation is more like a chaotic drum beat, out of rhythm, and that can bring on blood clots, heart failure, and stroke. You have the upstairs, you have the downstairs, and you have electricity going on at the top of the heart, and it's coordinated to beat and pump in a fashion so that blood gets to the rest of your body by going from the top down through the middle of the heart, out to the bottom of the heart, into the basement. The top chambers of the heart is where the problem lies for atrial fibrillation. Lub dub, lub dub, lub dub. High blood pressure, diabetes, or even sleep apnea can bring it on. The treatment may include medication or maybe even electrical shock to your heart. So do you feel short of breath? Do you feel like you're, you know, just getting older and older and you're losing your oomph? Well, that could be ineffective blood pumping, atrial fibrillation. They want to talk to your doctor about that. Out of rhythm. Mm-hmm. Out of rhythm. Out of rhythm.